Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to a brand new video of FIFA Mobile. This is episode 3. And um, yeah, we just won another league tournament, which makes it five in a row, guys. And that means, that means something really cool. Let's go have a look, guys, because I believe it will unlock an achievement. And there it is, achievement unlocked. So let's claim our three league points. Um, now, if I go to campaigns and I go to the Deli Alley, uh, what I wanted to do today, guys, was um, go ahead and get this one here for 20 league points and redeem the 25 time level 100 things for my Deli Alley. Um, but I only have nine. But with this achievement, um, I can go ahead and, uh, and show you guys what we get for the achievement. But before we do that, actually, I just want to show you guys the team real quick. I sold my Meza Urzil. Um, that's why I've got over over there. That's why I've got 1.2 million coins. Um, he sold. He sold. Yeah, he sold for just uh, just over a million. I think 1 million and 80. Um, so that's pretty. That's pretty cool. I'm, I've genuinely forgot how much I bought him for. So I'm not sure if I made profit on it or not. But I'll definitely take it. Um, of course, Ozil was a six. My Deli Ali is a five. But of course, I'm hoping now with what I'm going to be getting that he'll be able to get to 88 because at 88, I believe I unlock the. Um, the rainbow flick. I've already got with uh, with Selke. So let's go into the achievements over here. Um, two in leagues for some reason. Not too sure why we've got two. So let's. What's this one? Well, just let's claim this one first and see what the other one's for. Um, and there you go. Point. And there it is. The 15 league points. That's huge. Absolutely huge, right there. Now, what's this one? What's this other one? Compete in five leagues. Oh, okay. So yeah, so yeah, the the one we got, the one I got pre previous was for winning five in a row. So not just competing in five, winning five in a row. So that's really cool that I've got a, a great league right now. Everyone's very active on it, so um, that's really cool. Now, campaign, Delhi Alley league rewards right there, and we should be good to go ahead and claim this. Let me just quickly. Quickly do this, guys, because I feel like I feel like someone's about to send me a message. So if I do that, no one should be sending me a message. But then, continue that. That is now done. Now, if we go to our deadly alley, I'm thinking that it's going to be very expensive, but um, it should should be all right. All right, so there he's already 86. Oh my God, we can actually get him. Super high, can't we? Wow, okay. That's that's it right there. It's gonna cost me 590k. Definitely worth it though. He is now a level 90! Oh goodness! That's that is awesome. I'm not that is awesome. I was expecting him maybe 88, 89, but 90. Let's freaking go. Um, that brings my team up to an 87 as well. He's got the rainbow flick now, so does Selke. Um, I'm still very annoyed that Ronaldo uh, level 90 doesn't for some crazy reason. But if we go on to train, we look at the agility. Oh, maybe not. Maybe he won't be able to do the, the flick, the rainbow flick. Well, there's only one way of finding out if he'll be able to do it, and that's by going to test him out. That's what we're going to go do. Uh, if we, what, what should we do? Should we do, yeah, let's do versus attack. I finally made it up to World Class 1, by the way. It resets. It's going to reset at nine, in, in nine hours. I think there's going to be an update to the game as well later on today. So that's going to be really, really cool. All right, let's try out this new team. Who? What team are we facing? We're facing an 89-rated team. Okay. Glad we got our team to, uh, to 87. Would have been a bigger disadvantage. So do that. That's the regular kickoff. I learned that from, from Bateson. <laughs> All right. Yes, you can do it. That was an awful shot. What am I even thinking there? I do not know. Cut back? No. Nope. Still nil nil, but I'm not doing very good. Again, I'm I'm really not gonna lie, guys. The way I have to plug this, oh god, this really, really like does not help situations because I don't normally hold my phone this way when I'm not when it's not plugged in like that. But it's okay. That's wide. I'm doing awful. That's an easy goal, but um, yeah, not 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 a good start right now. At least it's one one. At least he seems to be struggling just as much as I am. That's an awful pass. Right, we got Ali. Flick, 
Flick again. Bury it. Bury it. Let's go, Ali. Come on. Damn it. 3-3. Three, three. Should have I won I should have buried that that chance. Let's go. 4-3. Come on. Victory! Let's do it! Deli Ali getting two or three goals, I believe. Salke getting a couple. Definitely take that victory. Rainbow Flick, I tell you guys, is a game changer. And I've got two players who can do it. Absolutely awesome, guys. And uh, yeah, let's go and uh, let's see how many. Well, yeah, 8,000 8, 8, 8, there. Takes me nice and uh, nice and um, clear of that danger spot. <laughs> don't, I, don't like, I don't like when I get promoted. I don't like going back down. Well, I don't, you don't get back down, I don't think. And, and, unless, I don't know, maybe if you lose a crap on you, you go down. But um, if you go down a little bit, you don't. But... It's just annoying, isn't it? It's just very annoying. But yeah, seven, seven hundred, seven hundred thousand for the world class or legendary or whatever it is. It's not world class. I'm on world class. <laughs> whatever the next thing is, um, it's just too much, isn't it? Uh, it's legendary. Sorry, it's legendary. I'm not going to be able to do it, especially in the next nine hours. I've got stuff to do, but that's okay. What we're going to do now is we're going to go to the events. I'm going to show you guys what I did for the matchups. I'm going to show you guys. Um, yeah, the, what my predictions basically. I think um, I, I I think I did a fairly good job um, of 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 it. I I kind of looked some stuff up. I kind of studied it a little bit, and then we'll play the team of the week, and uh, probably wrap it up there, guys. So let's have a look at what I did. So we'll start off with this one: Fenerbahce versus Galatasaray. Um, so Galatasaray right now top of the Turkish league. Um, been doing very well in their last couple games. I think they scored like six goals and some, somewhere like that in their last game or recently. They're doing very well now. Fenerbahce aren't that far behind. Uh, they're, they're a couple of spots behind, but on point, points ways they're not that far behind. But um, that said, I do feel like Galatasaray are in form right now, and they will get that win away from home as well. So it's a bit of a risky one here, um, but of course every one of them are risky because you never know what's going to happen. If we move over to this one, we got Lincoln. Uh, versus uh, Crimsby Town in League Two, um, and again this one, this one probably was the easiest one for me. Uh, Lincoln are doing way better than Grimsby Town in their league. It's it's at Lincoln. I went with a Lincoln win there. Now we move on to this one. Uh, we've got Shamrock Rovers. <coughs> we got some Pats. Um, now this one, this one was probably the. This one was like the, the odd one out for me. I was like, mm, I really do not. I don't know anything about the Irish league. Um, I don't. I don't really. I look. I looked at the table, of course. Looked at how they've been doing. Um, Shamrock Rovers have been doing a little bit better than some bats. So by that alone, I was like, okay, well, it's at home. Just gonna go for that win. Uh, as you guys can see, haven't gotten a draw so far here in the three we've predicted. But um, the other matchups: Marseille against Lyon, uh, Lyon, um, Marseille, the team I support course alongside Arsenal and um, yeah the thing is I didn't go with a Marseille win I went with a draw guys I went with a draw because I'm gonna look at I, I, I looked at it this way okay yes it's at Marseille we've been we've been very good at the velodrome um, stadium at Marseille um, if I go with a Marseille win though and they draw I'm like god damn it <laughs> you know I'm still very happy that Marseille won but then I'm like you know disappointed that I didn't get this but the way I've done it now is like, if Marseille win, wait, no, wait, what? If I picked Marseille and, I, and they, I mean they drew, I, I suppose I'd be happy because Marseille won, but I got it wrong. Wait, no, what? No, it, okay. My, <laughs> god damn it. I'm trying to, I'm trying to explain. I'm trying to explain why I did this. Basically, if Lyon lose, I'm not happy anyway. And if I predict Lyon, I don't know. I don't know. There's no explanation actually. In my head, I thought, it's easy. I'm going to go with the draw because... That way, if, if Marseille do win, I'm happy, and if they don't, if they draw, then I've got it right in this game, so I suppose there's something to take away from that, and if Lyon lose, then I'm not happy anyway, so screw it. Whatever, guys, that was, that was, the, that was the, that was probably a very funny moment right there for you guys, cringy, but 
Quite funny. Um, I went with a draw. Uh, I don't know what you guys did. Do let me know what you did down below if there's a reason for what you did. Um, I really hope Lyon don't win. <laughs> I really hope they don't win now. And as I said, if Marseille do win, then I'm just happy because Marseille won the rival. You know, this it's, it's a rivalry, Marseille Lyon. It's, uh, it's yeah, it's not it's not Arsenal Tottenham. That's probably Marseille PSG, but it's a uh, it's a good Arsenal Chelsea. So, um, yeah, but yeah, um, if I do get all of them right, I'm not going to lie, guys, I'm probably not going to go for the Mandanda. I'm going to go for the training points here because I have a better keeper than the Mandanda, so I don't need that. And, of course, if I only get a couple right, then we're just going to redeem a couple of these. So that is it, guys. Let's go play the team of the week. And I'll show you guys how many points we've got. And I already played what? I played the team of the week. You know, yeah, I can play it in, in four hours. Rip. So I guess I'm not playing now. But I do want to show you guys how many points I've got. Because, look, this Ribery, it's fairly expensive. But I do, I'm do. i almost on 3k um, Team of the Week points. So I'll save up for the next week. But this Ribery would really help me out um, in the next formation I'm going to do when I hit level 26. So two more levels. Because let's just say I'm level 24 right now. Um, we're getting there. I said I'm still I'm still not like I'm still not there yet. But what I want to do is obviously use this 433 diamond right here. Sorry, the 343 diamond. I keep saying 43. 343 diamond. Um, have Ronaldo, Lamar. Okay, so Ronaldo left wing, Lamar left mid. So Selke so okay, striker. Um, Deli Ali Cam with uh, Morgan Sanson in CDM. So get rid of Aaron Rams and Rabio. Have Joe Cancelo as my right winger, and then I could have Ribery as that left mid. That's my attack and midfield done. Um, and then in uh, in yeah in the, my three centre backs I'd probably uh, I'd probably get like obviously Salkazar and Sadibe. Um Musaccio, I'm not gonna lie I, I love him he scores so many corners for me and I'll just get someone else you know like uh, I entered uh, Bateson's uh, thing with for that Otamendi guys check that out on Twitter if you guys want to have a chance in winning that um, so you know that's not gonna happen is it but imagine if I did win that that'd be a great um, great pair at the back there but yeah. That's what I kind of want to do for, for this team, but for right now, it's going to stay a 4-3-3 for the time being, probably for quite a while, because I'm not going to make level 26 like tomorrow. Uh, it'll probably be about a week, something like that, before I do. Um, and I'm sitting on 655k, all things considered, selling Ozil for like a million coins. Why, you know, that I think I think that was a great decision. Now we got this Deli Alli to 90th with the, with the whole league points thing, that's absolutely awesome. There we got this Deli Alli up, and... Um, and now the only thing I'm, I don't know about is if we keep doing these uh, these league tournaments, what else is there for me to go get? Oh yeah, there's another reward tab, is there? Isn't there? Oh yeah, league points, league points, league points. A legendary trophy. What's the point in that? 400k. Okay. And then some some skill. Oh, skill boosts. It's interesting. So yeah, there's always this actually. I don't, I don't really look at this to be totally honest. So yeah, they, they would. Well, I did because I did this one, didn't I? But I didn't really look at it properly. So once, once the whole Deli Ali stuff is done, and I'm don't really need to level him up anymore, then we can uh, do that. But do I have any points? Left? I do have, I do have points left. Do we go ahead and do that just so we can complete it? Nah, it's pointless. We'll just save up for the next one. So guys, that's going to be the end of the video. We got Deli Ali. To level 90, he's got the rainbow flick now. I'm going to be waiting for this update. Of course, the season ends in nine hours in the versus attack, which means we'll be going back down. I don't know to where because never experienced it before. Um, yeah, yeah, very, very, very funny moment in that whole uh, matchups thing with Marseille and Lyon. But yeah, thank you so much for watching, guys. Drop this video like again. The more likes, the more I'm going to do some FIFA mobile episodes for you guys. Take care. Bye for now.